Golden Dragon's ride! Wow! Neat! Give me a break! I don't like this! Whoa! What's happening? Whoa! Where are we? Look out! Fear not, Ranger! Barbarian, magician, thief, cavalier, and acrobat. Who was that? That was Venger, the force of evil. I am Dungeon Master, your guide in the realm of Dungeons and Dragons. said he'd meet us on the other side of the moon for us. We've got to keep moving. Keep moving? Are you kidding? I couldn't see my hand if I held it up in front of my oh, face. Okay, okay. We'll bed down here and continue in the morning. Here, Bobby. This will keep you warm. <sighs> Thanks, sis. Oh! Boy, I trade my shield in a second for a heated hotel room. Don't worry about it, Eric. From the valleys of Crown to the hills of Zorm, conjure me something to keep us warm. Wow, I did it. An electric blanket. Great. Now all you need to do is whip up a power plant so we can plug it in. Well, if you don't want it, I'll take it. Dungeon Master? But I thought you were going to meet us. Things have changed, Ranger. I came to warn you. About what? Are we in danger? Your friends will find great jeopardy, but you will face the most difficult trial of your life. Be strong, Ranger, and listen to your heart. Dungeon Master? Wait! Uh. Shield, you thieving fuzzball! Hold it right there! I got one! I'll take that! Let me go! Bite them, Bob them! Bite them! How I bite them? I can't see them! All right, you little kleptos, start talking! We didn't do anything! You were going to hurt! We were only defending ourselves. Let us go. Whoa! One at a time. Who are you? We are cloud bears. We not steal weapons. We take so you not harm us. Yes, we need them to defend ourselves. From who? The forest ranger? No, from the green ones. They have ugly, flat noses and tusks that stick up and mean eyes. Wait a minute. I know that description. It's coming. It's coming. Ah! It's here! Orc soldiers! Get them! <laughs> Oh, great! 
We'd need a rocket ship to climb that tree. Hank! <laughs> Then you take two, I'll take 18. Huh? Why did you tell us you had an elevator? You didn't ask. Oh, oh, well, oh, what are we waiting for? Oh, ah! Wait a minute! So Wait so a minute! It. Come on! Pull him up! I'm trying! <laughs> Funny. Uh, where are you taking us? I take you home. Yeah? Where's that? Guys, look. Wow. I send you for weapons to fight the green ones, and you bring these creatures? They're friends, King Kamala. They helped us escape green ones. So be it. The Cloud Bear Colony welcomes you. Hi. What's that? It is the green ones. They attempt to cut down our tree. We've got to stop them. But how? We have no weapons. Well, what do you have? Only fruits and nuts. Okay, ready. Bobby and Hank have got to be around here somewhere. We shoot harpoons into trees, <laughs> then climb ropes, get bears. Good, but make sure you wait until I fire the signal arrow before you begin your attack. I have to make sure my friends can't use their weapons to defend the cloud bears. <laughs> So tell Venger not to worry. I'll take care of everything. <laughs> he, he betrayed us. His best friends. They've moved back. They seem to be waiting for something. Well, we're out of ammunition. If they attack again, we're finished. I cannot quite see through the clouds. Wait. Lower the elevator at once. Yeah, thanks. What happened? When, where's Bobby? The, uh, the orcs took Bobby and me to their camp. I, I managed to escape, but Bobby couldn't. That's a lie! Sheila! What's the matter? Ah, uh, I went to the orc camp. I saw Hank. He was talking with the orcs. They were planning our capture. He he's working with them now. No, th that's not true. Yes, it is. Uh, Hank wouldn't betray us. Sheila, we've all been under a lot of strain. You're imagining things. Don't touch me. He's working for Venger and I can prove it. When he fires a signal arrow, the orcs are going to attack. You've got to be wrong, Sheila. I'm not wrong. Fire that arrow and you'll see. Fire an arrow, Hank. Settle this thing once and for all. Go on, Hank. Show her she's wrong. Oh... See, he's innocent. They have seen your signal. I don't believe it. What a traitor. Hank, why? Take cover! The green ones come! Captured at the hands of the orcs. Cloud bears cold. 
Now why didn't I think of that? A game of patty cake will stop an army of raging orcs any day. Good grief! Not game! Cloud Bear's protected by Cloud Spirit! Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure. And he throws lightning bolts with his bare hands, too. Didn't mean it, just, just kidding! Yeah! Sheila, easy. What do you think we ought to do with, with this traitor? Wait a minute. A person is innocent until proven guilty. We can't pass judgment on Hank without a, a trial or something. A trial? What does this look like? The Supreme Court? Well, is the battle over? Yes, Master. But it is the orcs who have lost. What? The cloud bears use their glowing charms to bring a storm. Again, they use the hot stones to defeat me. Those foolish bears possess the only element in this world that I am powerless against. And they don't even know it. The ranger had better not fail me next time, or the young barbarian will suffer. You're wasting your time, you big dope. Hank would never do anything to hurt his friends. Never! Why'd you do it, Hank? Was it something we did? Come on, Hank. If you don't talk to us, we can only assume you're guilty. I'm not guilty. I'm... Well, that does it. He, he must be guilty. Otherwise, he'd tell us what happened. Make him tell what he did to Bobby. Where's my brother? Take it easy, Sheila. But what if treason isn't the only thing he's guilty of? What if he's guilty of... <gasps> oh, Bobby! We put our trust in you, Hank. After all we've been through together. All those times you've, you've helped us keep going. Helped us believe in ourselves. Now this. I'll never trust anyone again as long as I live. Custom. Heart stone bring luck. Thanks. Take care of yourself, Hank. What's the matter, human? Got no friends no more? Why couldn't I have made them understand? I had no choice. I'm not a traitor! Oh, but you are, Ranger. Dungeon Master, you think I'm a traitor too? Not in the way the others do. You are a traitor to your own courage and insight. But Venger has Bobby. He warned me not to say a word. If I try and stop him, there's no telling what might happen. True. But if you don't try to stop him, you know what will happen. There is an old saying in these parts. He who has the answer and doesn't know it is just as lost as he who never knew. You have the answer, Ranger. It is as close to you as the wind. Dungeon Master? Shadow Demon tells me you failed to help capture the Cloud Bears. Yeah, I blew it, so sue me. I'll do worse than that. No, stop! Don't hurt Bobby! No harm will come to him, as long as you continue to do as I say. But betray me once more, and... I won't cross you, Venger. I promise. Good. Now go. And bring me the cloud bears. Hank, don't do it. Venture could do what he wants with me. I don't care. Some good luck charm you are. Hank, 
A hot stove! Get it away! Get it away! It is gone, Master. Yes, but I won't rest until I have destroyed all of the stones. We get them this time. Oh no! The orcs are climbing the tree next door. We've got to rig up a line of defense. Stand back. I'll try my hat again. Uh, hocus pocus. No. Uh, abracadabra. No, that's not it. Uh, no, what the heck? Just blow those bums away. Hey, cut it out! Stop! Hey, look at that! It's as big as a blimp. That's it! You're a genius, Presto. I am. <laughs> you to have our last heartstone to protect you from Vinja. No, we have our weapons. Your people need the stone to live in peace. I... I want to apologize for calling you a traitor, Hank. I'm, I'm really sorry. It's okay, Eric. I should have had the courage to talk to you all instead of keeping silent. Well said, Ranger. Dungeon Master! Now that you are friends once again, I have news of a possible way home. All right! Dungeon Master! So what's the news? 
you will find a clue in the land of blue fire. Only three days' journey through the bottomless swamps. B -b -b bottomless fire? B -b 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 blue swamp? Oh. Hey, no problem. Let's go. Say, Dungeon Master. Dungeon Master? Ah, I wanted to ask him to shrink my magic hat. Presto, no! Yeah! Eric! Come on, you guys, give me a hand! <laughs> 